as a foreigner like me, how do I begin uh, uh, if I were there uh, in person? What kind of activity, what kind of uh, um, event to join some event? What do you... So, uh, like, let's begin with some assumption because so you need to have like the, something in your mind. Then you can like like take yeah. action. So, for example, okay. you say like you you are a person like from any any country in the world. You have a business idea. You have like yes. a proposal, and yes. now you want to like make connections. Potentially find some like possibly find some potential investor or like some connections that can help you to launch your idea. So this is like our assumption. So okay. The first thing that I would do is like search on the Google and find the website of the calendar of the events is happening in Dubai. So then mm. I will adjust my visit to that calendar, like which is like suits my like business idea. This is the first thing. Like the Dubai Expo dot AE, I guess it's the website. I'm not sure, but you like everybody can search and find the calendar like mm. events that's happening. Uh, then the I would understand uh, the culture of the like business culture of Dubai. So for example, now I can say in Dubai, so like coffee meeting uh, even as a business is not uh, common. So everybody is meeting oh. in the lobby of the hotel. Mm, okay. So that's the like business culture there. So if you have a meeting, either you will meet in the office or you will meet in the lobby of like any hotels, like coffee meeting, restaurant meeting by like business meeting and food and uh, drink are not uh, together like in Dubai. It's I mean, it's uh, still there is like some people doing this, but I'm talking about general terms. I don't talk about like the extremums. Yeah, I'm about the general terms. Yes, yes. Yeah. So, I would go visit the lobby of the hotel I'm staying, and most of the hotels they have the conference hall, conference room that like some of the events are happening. So I would also ask the the reserve like the reservation desk uh, at the hotel to like what's happening like among my staying what's happening like in the hobby that I can in the lobby that I can attend as well so that's another thing mm -hmm. so already I guess like with two these two three items like people can make uh, like connections and beforehand you can make connections like through LinkedIn like that and then like just made appointment just made an appointment and like tell them like, okay, I'm visiting Dubai. This is my schedule. I would be like free every day, for example, after 6 p.m. And if you have time, we can just meet up for uh, like the lobby meeting. I mean, in the lobby meeting, like you can drink like coffee, non-alcoholic, alcoholic, but like it's different type of meeting rather than to like go to the cafe, coffee shop or like everything. Because cafe, coffee shop is just no business talking mostly. It's a different environment. Yes. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Obviously. Yeah. But would would you say like like uh, people are generally on time in this culture? They it's are because they are like back to back or visiting different people. So like five okay. minutes for them is five minutes. Okay, so they 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 promise something. They they show yeah. up. Yeah. The speed yeah. the speed of business life in Dubai is way more high. The higher it's than fast. any countries yeah. from right now. Yeah. Oh, I do know that. Yeah, this is just uh, familiar um, from the uh, Eastern Asian uh, countries. <laughs> yes. Um, so, yeah. So for your service, like I understand, like you are uh, you are going to uh, um, you are already have some connection then, and you are in the process of making a company there. Um, yes. So. So like you are already making some network, yeah? Like you. Hey, I already, I already build up some network according to my business idea and my plan and yes. what I want to do. Uh, I already set some appointment as well, like through LinkedIn, okay. like in October. Uh, mm. So like in September, I would be busy with like moving and stuff. Like in October, like second half of October, I set like three appointment to meet and yeah. 
because like uh, finishing the paperwork and stuff so i would be allowed to i like, would be able and allowed to do like trading and business so not beforehand mm -hmm. that's cool yeah you want to um so just take your example like what kind of uh, business you do and uh, what why because of that business uh, nature you choose dubai right yes so do so for me it's uh, i choose dubai so it's like close to my country first of all yes second mm. tax mm. purpose third the market uh, market growth so there i can do the fundraising i can visit investor like faster i can like uh, like sell my service and product way more faster than anywhere if my product is competitive and it's in the right mm. uh, like like offering like in the right uh, like right language and uh, so but mostly is because of the market and networking leverage in dubai and of course i'm mm. looking i i always like look in the expanding mode so i'm not gonna just stay in dubai but the headquarters and the basic would be in dubai and then it will expand mm. to other countries like hopefully in in next two three years it will expand to other countries but like the basic and the headquarters would be like in dubai i see yeah so like because we are mentioning this this would be uh i think we can uh we'll discuss even more um because basically um since you have lots of experience you know uh, doing business set up companies and running a company so really I'm really interested in like, you know, what is in your mind, you know, regarding um, um, a perfect ideology, you know, um, your business idea is unique, yeah, um, comparing to other people. So uh, that's why we're discussing this. Uh, now we are taking the city as an example. Example. Um, yes. So in your mind, do you also have other cities in the world that you think it might meet into your ideal, um, you know, business environment? Like maybe you can uh, mention few. Yeah, I mean, uh, so for my idea, also like the state market, it's a it's a nice market, but so now at could this you explain, moment, could you explain what is the state market? Could you? The market of United States, like America. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. I see. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah. because that they have like the biggest GDP in the world and like the the fastest growth, but like Emirates will catch them soon. So, and, like relatively according to the size of the country, like the Emirates will mm -hmm. catch the growth speed growth of like the America so fast in next mm -hmm. one year, two year, they will cross from America. But uh, mm. still, uh, the culture in, in like the United States of America and US is uh, different. So everybody loves like shopping online. Everybody loves uh, like better customer service, customer journey. So if you are providing a nice service, it you can scale it very fast. And because it's in the dollar, so it's like the stable like currency in the world. Everything will exchange to the like US dollar. So then like you are also preventing some like minor like exchange rate, like dramas, like financial stuff. Yes, tax purpose is different in America. State by state in America is different. Of course, you need to be yes. aware of mm. those. But mm. the growth, like the speed growth is like fast. But like for me, so better option is like Dubai near me. I know the culture. I can adopt faster and I can like catch those. Then I can give branch to like state to Canada to like European countries like later on. Exactly. Yeah. What kind of currency they use in Dubai? Dirham. So it's like only in, in the Amirate or? Uh, I mean, they have they have like the mm, their own Dirham, but like another country in, in Emirate also use Dirham, but it's different exchange rate. Yeah, I'm always curious, you know, like because a country can have a uh, maybe two or three official language, but they can only have one currency. Yeah, is it correct? Uh, I mean, in my country, we have two currency. Yeah, I mean, oh, I mean really? like yeah, we have oh. two currency. 
Uh, but like one of them is like official governmental uh, like currency. One of them is like daily exchange with like trading with people like supermarket, like the going like paying for taxi. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a very interesting stuff. Currency can be one topic later. Currency uh, to is one discuss. of the very, very uh, big topic that yeah. either you can lose yeah. a lot or you can win a lot on like the exchange <laughs> rate and, and like on the currencies. Yes, um, I got it. Yeah, it's uh, even with uh, the city as the example, I think we can uh, have more to discuss because I would like to know what do you think about New York as well. Maybe yeah, you sure. would like to sure, talk sure, about sure. that next time. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay. So um, thank you for your time today. Always thank nice. Thank you for your time uh, today. Thank with you. So see you next time. Okay. See you next time. See you. Ciao. Ciao.